Hello guys, welcome to another video. Got another package here for you guys, and um, I believe I know what's in here. I am not 100% sure what's in here. I believe it's a lead holder, but I'm not 100% sure what exactly what it is because it's been a while that I ordered this, and it actually took a while for this to arrive. So let's uh, go ahead and um, crack this open here and let's see what this is okay so okay oh yes so it is another lid holder i was looking forward for this one as well um okay let's see here if, uh, I gotta really, I gotta start remembering what the, what this stuff is when I order it and whatnot. Let's see what this is. What this guy is. This is from Creative Color as well. This particular one, and this is Creative Color wooden. So I guess it's just a wooden mechanical pencil. It's a 5.6 millimeter lead holder. And uh, this was also ordered through Amazon as well. So I will be putting a link down below for this as well. So you guys can go ahead and purchase it if you guys are interested. Um, by using the link does, uh, does help me out. So I do appreciate that. Let's take a look here. Wow, this actually does feel like actual wood. So I wouldn't wanna, I wouldn't wanna get this wet. That's for sure. It's absolutely gorgeous. I think if it got some um, like a clear coat or something on here, it'll probably look a lot nicer. That's probably something I may have to do. Let's just bring this a little closer here. So we got Creative Color. So uh, Ecologic model number four, four thirty twelve. Australia so I guess it was made in Australia wow very nice actually and I kind of like kind of like this little uh, divot here to actually makes it easy for it to, for you to hold it it's pretty cool and it's got a, a kind of uh, so this has got the longer leads so I'm wondering if these magic uh, leads Hard leads here would fit on it. Let's see here. Yeah, so it does fit. So these ones will fit with this particular uh, lead holder here. So if you guys saw this little quick little video on these, and you saw it on my other uh, on my blue mechanical pencil, then it did not fit. So on this one here, it actually fits because it's uh, longer. So that's uh, good to know. So if you think about getting those. Um, I count out those, uh, uh, those colored leads, you know, something like this is something you're going to have to uh, kind of look into as well. Um, I've got my, uh, this blue one here as well, which is a 5.6 as well, and you can kind of see the difference in lengths between the two. Right, so the other one's slightly longer, the wooden one's slightly longer than uh, this guy here is. So, but because it's got this little notch here, it doesn't feel as thick as this one does. So yeah, this is actually pretty nice. Um, the only concern is having this wood kind of get the uh, get stained and whatnot. Let's see how this feels like. So you guys remember this here? Let's bring this in closer a little bit, and. Uh, Let's just bring this out a little bit. Let's give this a try. Wow. You can tell that this lead's slightly uh, darker shade than, uh, than uh, this lead up here. Pull this back a little bit so you guys can see a little bit better what I'm doing here. So I don't know if it shows up under these bright lights or not, 
but this lead is a little bit darker than this lead is over here this was from my uh, cuddle, colored leads so what you see here is actually from these leads right here so yeah actually nice uh, nice holder I don't think I would want to do long running sessions with this but you know something like this if you if you happen to be a carpenter in my in my opinion if you happen to be a carpenter and uh, you want to you want to use a uh, carpenter's pencil you can use something like this because the lead's thick right and the lid won't break as easy it's just the thing you got to keep in mind is keeping it sharp right I don't know if a regular sharpener would work with this and unfortunately I don't think I have a sharpener here at the moment that I could test this on because I'm pretty sure just a regular pencil sharpener like a manual one would probably work to sharpen this I'm, I'm guessing um, let's see here so I got a regular pencil here right and I'm just curious if this is actually it's about the same size as the pencil don't go nowhere yeah so the pencil itself is actually slightly just slightly larger than uh, than the actual pencil is you can kind of see it there a little bit so you should be able to use a regular sharpener you use the, like a manual sharpener not not, not an electric one and I don't think it'd be a good idea to put this to an electric sharpener it probably wouldn't be very safe but I like a manual sharpener I think if you use a manual sharpener to sharpen one of these type of pencils should be pretty safe to sharpen this guy up here using that so probably down down uh, down the future here I'll uh, I'll dig out one of my sharpeners maybe I'll do it when I'm doing my my uh, lead series I'll, I'll probably demonstrate that to see if it does work or not but uh, for this moment here I'm pretty sure that it will work so this is the creative color Ecologic bottle number 4 430 5.6 lead holder or mechanical I don't know if you would want to call it a mechanical pencil because it's not really a mechanic it's got a clutch on it so I probably the proper term for something like this would be a lead holder so yeah so that's pretty much my uh, initial uh, unboxing and little first impressions of the creative color ecologic pencil if you enjoyed this video give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed the rest of my content please consider subscribing and I will be adding a link in the comments below for this particular uh, lead holder this was also packed up at Amazon as well so if you guys want to go ahead and, uh, and purchase it right you guys are more than welcome to use the link that I got on there it helps me out financially and uh, yeah until the next video goodbye